Hi friends, today we're going to learn about George Washington Carver. He did amazing things with plants. George Washington Carver was born a slave in 1864. He lived in Missouri. And when he was a little boy, he loved growing plants and playing in the field. George really liked to explore nature and really had a desire to learn more about it. When he was 11 years old, he left home and he relocated to a town named Neosho. There, he went to school because he couldn't go to school in his hometown because he was a slave. So George went on to college and in college, he started to learn more and more about plants such as the peanut, the sweet potato, and soybean. George was especially fascinated by peanuts. People started to call George the peanut man because he did lots of important things with peanuts. But George loved other plants too, and he found lots of different things to do with those as well. And he later became a professor at Tuskegee Institute in Alabama, and there he taught how to cultivate the soil and grow crops. He shared his knowledge with all who were interested, and that is a part of his legacy, that George was able to share his knowledge with the world. So as you know, George is one of those people in black history who helped to change the world. And here are some of his inventions and discoveries. He worked with, as you know, peanuts and sweet potatoes, and he developed a lot of different things from those different vegetables. Even though George Washington Carver lived a long time ago, his plant discoveries still help us today and we can learn from him and take care of plants, nature, and our environment just like he did. I'm so glad you decided to join me today as we talked about George Washington Carver. And if you are interested in learning some more about black history leaders, then check out some of the other videos that I have posted and you hopefully will enjoy those too. Thank you so much. My name is Erica and I'm the Polished Educator. Please like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for upcoming videos. And again, thanks for watching.